Hello, hello, this is Klar132, bringing you all some more Grand Theft Auto 5. And as I said in the last episode, this time I will be uh, going ahead and doing a round of golf. And I think I was taking a picture of this car. But anyways, so I'm going to try and do a round of golf this episode. Because as I said, I want to stagger everything out, you know, play some missions, and then do some of the, uh, you know, fun side jobs, side things you can do, and such. So we're going to go ahead and go up and see if I can play golf. I believe, I think, I know it costs money to play a game of golf. I don't remember how much. And golf club. But I know once we get to the properties, which is fun to play with, you know, getting all buying properties and such. I know you can buy the country club, but that is going to be a long process. Because if I remember right, that's a hundred and fifty million dollar property. So, and by the end of the game, I don't, uh, I don't remember how much I had for my characters, but one of the trophies that we do have to do is spend two hundred million dollars across the board of characters. So that is probably going to take a while. Definitely going to take a while actually. I know it will. But we will see how that goes. Oh shoot. No! Oh boy, the truth is going to kill me for that. Because I know how much he loves his exotic sports cars on GTA. His favorites are the Maserati. No, the car is based off Maseratis. And ooh man. I wrecked one of those. Oh boy, I think he was ready to hit me. Because I jacked that car up. Oh shoot, I gotta go around. That's right. Out of board. And whoop. Get up here and from Screech. Press onward. And golfing! Is anybody here? There's nobody here at all. So you can actually still play golf, or is it closed? You're not authorized to be here. Oh, activity between 6 and 18. Okay. Security one. You know what I will do? I hope instead I'm gonna change and take the Banshee. Oh crap. Come on, how are- I love how that guard- Obviously this alarm is going off, and this guy is not paying attention to this car alarm. Such a weird car alarm in my opinion. I don't think I've ever heard a car alarm like that. So alright, let's go ahead and see what's going on in the game. It is currently 23, oh that sucks. So I guess I need to head up to Michael's place so he can sleep, and then we'll be able to play some golf. Oh crap. How did they see me? I guess I'm on the street. So alright, here we go. Into his house. And I'll park this in the garage, even though it'll probably magically disappear at some point in, in the game. I don't know why, but... I'll be Is peace and quiet too much to ask for? The kids, the kids, always the kids. Alright. Save the game, so you have to save it as usual. This will speed up time and, you know, advance it up to whatever. So, new save, save it as chaos. Or our 8.3% save file. Can I click on save? <laughs> So, what? Let's see. I need to think of something for you guys to make a comment about. Let's uh, let's go with uh, favorite Grand Theft Auto so far. We'll go with that as a question. So, out of all of the Grand Theft Autos from the very beginning, what is your favorite? Before this, I would have said that uh, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas was my favorite. But, so far, I'm seeming to like 5 a lot, 
It honestly will depend on how GTA Online turns out. Because I know San and playing San Andreas Online, and I'm talking computer mod, uh, multi theft auto, was pretty much partially what put San Andreas to the top of my A list of the game. But its single player was still quite the amazing piece of work as well, so. But this, I think this actually does top the single player of San Andreas, in my opinion. Sad it doesn't have, you know, San Piero and Las Venturas, but we'll see what GTA Online beholds. If it, if GTA Online goes well, then this definitely will probably be my favorite GTA so far. But if it does not pan out so well, I will probably still say San Andreas is above all my favorite. But I guess we're just gonna have to see. So, all right, here we are. Time to play us the nine holes of golf, hundred dollars entry fee. So I remember that I unlock challenges to play against by completing a round of golf. So during golf, you must attempt to get the ball from the tee onto the green and into the cup with the lowest number of strokes. Truth, if you watch this, don't say a word about that. I know you will make a comment. Go walk, ride a golf cart, or skip ahead. And Let's go for, it. for the sake of this, I am going to try not to skip ahead or anything like that. I'll try and walk or, you know, use the golf cart to run all, all over the place. So yeah, that, that allows you to... Basically, your strength stat determines how far you can hit the golf ball and... Or tennis ball and stuff like that. And everything like that. I shouldn't stand right there. So approach the tee, you have to approach it on foot. And here is the first, it's a par 5, 531 yard. So they've done definitely a really good in-depth job with the way this works. I just gotta kinda remember everything. Um, preview. Oh yeah, then right, oh no, I wanna preview the shot. So then you can kinda move it around and everything like that. So I'll put it about right there, I think is a good one. And then, and they give you the best, I think they uh, set it to where you basically start with the best club for your position. Shoot. Oh, shooting oh, shots. Oh, swing down. I think that's what you're supposed to do is go to that point. Yeah, alright. Strength, yeah, strength 81%. That's the way I Drive it. 201 yards. New record. So, alright, so then go ahead and get on my golf cart and ride up to where the ball is at. So this is hole one of nine, so I will try to complete all nine holes for everybody. And let's see, so you can kind of see sort of where the ball is. You generally have to just use your mini map to find it. But, eh, this works, so it's all good. So usually I will just auto always go to this view just so I can see exactly where I'm putting the ball as I swing. Oh, there we go, 99%. Beautiful shot. Beautiful shot. So as you can see right over there, the red flag. Kind of center screen, might be a little bit hard to see, but... That's where I'm going for the hole. So, hop in our golf cart. And buzz away. And uh, we'll press on to, hopefully, it might take me maybe two more shots, I think. I shouldn't have to worry about it too much. I think it's only going to be two more that I have to do. Alright, here we are. Here's the ball. And we will, of course, do my little R2. Ooh, I don't like this club. Or this guy change it. Ooh, definitely don't like that either. I guess I'll go for that and try and not... There. Well, alright, I, I kind of don't like how I place the ball. I guess I'll go with that and hope that I can... Not max out my strength shots, so it'll... No, 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 darn it. That sucks. Fuck this okay, shit. I might par Fuck now. And yeah, now I'm probably gonna par the first hole, that sucks. So I know that some people... So basically, uh, for those of you that are wondering, all that is going to happen in this episode at all is this golf, and then I'm going to end the video once I finish golfing. So if you would like, you can press on to the next video if you don't want to watch some golf. Because to get, but because I'm going to 100%, I do need to, I'm going to play until I, I'm going to do every little bit of it. 
just so we make sure that I do get all of the nice stuff line. done. And then, yeah, yeah, once you get close enough, you'll just push it right in and finish up. So as you can see, E5, so I'm par so far. All in one under par and over par. Huh, even though I'm, yeah, I guess as of right now, technically I guess I'm under par, even though I haven't even shot yet. You, what the, what are you doing here? Why are you blow drying near that thing? I thought I'd beat you down. But I can't. If you actually hit a guy, then you actually fail the golfing challenge because it's considered breaking the rules of the golf course. So, whatever you do, don't break the rules of the golf course, and you'll be fine. So, so here we are, hole number two. I remember the country club in San Andreas actually did not include golf. I believe it had tennis. But you couldn't even play the tennis, and I believe that was all there was. So, swing, 88%. Not too shabby of a shot. Not the best alignment, because I think it's in line kind of with the tree. But, oh, new record, 242 drive. 242 yard drive. That's nice. Very well. So in San Andreas, I know they have tennis courts here, but they were unplayable, and then... That, I believe, was all they really had. I'll drive all the way up to here just to save a little bit of time. Because then I just gotta run across the sand. Well, around the sand, I'm not gonna run through the sand. Actually, ho! Jump over the sand. <laughs> Alright, so now, still heading way down there. Ooh, I hate that shot very much. That's a lot better. Oh, I didn't swing it. What the heck? Oh, I guess I didn't press forward in time. Nope, it's not swinging forward. Oh, right, there it goes. And don't tell me you're gonna put it in the dirt again. Oh, I love my sandwich. I guess that's hole three, maybe. Yeah, I think that might be hole three right there. Sorry, right. and drive up. Oh, I'm just gonna. Across this. Thankfully, this ain't against court rules, as far as I know. All they care is that you, uh... Just don't kind of kill anybody, and you'll be fine. Ah, uh, can I not go up? Oh, up one might be too... Eh. I'll take my chance. Eh, I'll take my chances with this, I guess. Oh, wait. Oh, hey, I can actually... I did not know I could change the way the shot went. I did not know you could actually do that. Go to right there. If I had known that you could actually... Oh, wow, that was terrible. If I had known that you could do that, I would have done so much better, but okay. Well, we learn something new every day, right? So, alrighty. And now we will approach this shot on foot right here. And then now I have to do a little tiny little bunt of a shot. And swing. Oh, right over it. Not and then, bad. okay, and I do have to approach it again. Ugh, I don't think I'm going to get par on this one. Beautiful. What the fuck is wrong with me? Yeah, bogey one over. Well, that's okay, that's okay. Now this may actually wind up having to be a two-parter because we're already at 13 minutes, so... Yeah, this may have to be a two-part, uh, two- or three-part episode just for golf. Because I am going to show all of it. You know, I don't want to not show you guys anything, or show not show everything that the game has to offer. I want everybody to see it all. Oh, that is a beautiful shot. Nice line. Yep, new closest to the pin. Six feet. Now, where is my... Okay, there's my golf cart. Yeah, they'll move the golf cart if you kind of leave it alone. They'll put the golf cart close to you in case you decide you want that option of using the golf cart. So, yeah, I think it's a pretty much a back-and-forth play with the golf cart. You just drive back and forth between... You go, like, up to go to one, then come back down for the next one, go up and then down and back and forth, so on and so forth. At least that's what I think. Oh, okay, it's right there. Beautiful. Birdie, alright, now I just made up that uh, bogey that I shot last time. 
blast hole. So alright, there we go with that one. And now head on to the next hole, which I'll try it up here. Okay, so I can. So what is this? Uh, hole four, par four, 324 yards. So my longest drive. Oh, this one looks like it's got some water to it at the end of it. Yeah, this has some water shots. I want to go that way with it. And swing! Perfect hit. Perfect hit is nice, nice That's and solid. The way I it. Longest drive on the hole, 184. What? Okay. It's a lot, but let's drive on up to this one. Press on. So what is everybody's favorite sport between, you know, like uh, basketball, football, stuff like that? Me, personally, I'm not too big into sports. Except, I guess, darts, if you consider that a sport. Darts, bowling, and I guess, eh, I guess I'm a little bit of a golfer. Uh, not too much, though. But, I don't ever watch golf myself. I personally just play it here and there. But, mostly, ooh, that is not at all bad. Not bad. Well done, green in regulation. Okay. But my personal favorite, I love darts most of all. Darts and bowling are my two favorite sports to do. Because, uh, I'm just pretty decent at those. I don't ever, I never really got into, like, baseball, football, all that. It's just, to me, it's not that interesting. Oh, wait, why am I going now? To me, those sports, it's just... Thank Partially you. probably because and of my whole little heart condition that I had. Kind of makes it to where I don't really play them. I don't want to play them, so therefore I don't really watch them ever. Because Mainly because it's the stuff, honestly, that kind of gets me bored a bit. Well, I have my favorite teams from each game, which generally is Chicago, because that's born and raised. So, But, for the most part, I just really don't care who wins games. Like, win hockey, who wins, all that stuff. See, where is this hole even aimed at? Oh, okay. Oh, so the first goal is to get that bad boy right over there. Over the, uh, over the water. Alright. Swing! Perfect hit. Alright. Not bad at all. Pretty far down there. This is hole, I believe this is hole 5. This is hole 5, par 4. Alright. So one... It is currently one, you know, it's 144. Once I do this, I have to go out and mow some more of the yard. Because the way I mow my yard, I kind of do it in increments. Drive right into the ocean. No, uh, I don't think I can do that. That is probably a stun jump right there. Oh crap. I didn't do it. I don't think they'd care if we kind of. Tested that. Oh, that's a fail theory. Okay. Well, that sucks. That was a failed theory. Alright, at least I can get out of there. Oh, well, golf cart sinks. That's fine. Run! Run! No big deal. Alright, hole 5, par 4. This is my second shot. Oh, there we go. That should be a beautiful shot right there. What the? That was not a perfect hit, I guess. Okay, I don't. I'm not. Uh, hmm. That's the way I played it. Okay, I think I get it now. Okay. I try to think why, because I know I aimed lower, but I figured out why. I know what the problem was. I did, I gave it a full shot when I didn't. When I shouldn't have for this. Oh, this is gonna be terrible. Let's see, going a little bit to the right when it drops off, so... Or not going a little bit to the right when it drops off. Whatever. Yeah. Perfect hit. Alright, there we go. Par. Alright, not bad. So I'm still ahead on the course. And I still got another six minutes. Let's see, did they put me another golf cart? No, they don't, so now you have to... Now I just have to run to the rest of them, so... I apologize for driving my golf cart into the uh, water, but what can you do at times, you know? Gotta go with what, what I did. And swing. Perfect hit again. Alright, 
I guess I'm getting better at golf. Uh, that's gonna. Oh, that's gonna be sucky. Not bad. Closest to pin. I think that might be on the hole, reach hole, maybe. Yeah, cause my golf. Yep, golf cart is gone. So I've got a couple more holes. We're getting close to done at least. Uh, on all six. And then we'll, yeah, next up is seven. So we're down to what is it? But this one, then seven, eight, nine, three holes left. Yep, three holes. And swing. Oh yeah, that's a nice shot. That's a nice shot. Alrighty, three to go. We might get this done this episode. Actually, yeah, I might have to. Depending on how long this takes me, I may have to press this video a little bit further in time. It's either I press this a little bit further in time, or I might have to um, open with a finish. Oh, right on the sidewalk. That sucks. I think that's out of regulation. So, yep, unplayable part. lie. Yep, have to redo that shot. Or oh wait, no, I think it'll just move it out a little bit. I think it'll move it onto the field where it is playable. Ah, darn. Oh no, well, you know, not not too bad. That was actually a decent shot. I just had it angle weird. So yeah, they put it right in play for you at least. Yeah, it moves to playable Y. Definitely want to put that there because I'm planning on getting at least almost a perfect shot. Or at least get over the sand. Uh, God. Uh, right in the dirt. Yeah. Off the sand. That sucks. Damn it. Sorry, we got four minutes left with yeah, this couple more holes to go. So hopefully we'll be able to finish this up. Swinging from the bunker reduces shot. Yeah, and accuracy. All that crap. Go way up here with a... Better swing here, power shot. Yeah, accuracy kills right there. Nice line. That's a long putt. Right there's the hole at least. So Oh, it didn't swing. And swing. Perfect hit. Oh, but it's off a little bit. I think you'll... Nope, okay, I guess he doesn't scoot up to this one. You know, that's... Are you kidding me? That... that's terrible. Oh! And there goes my actual good score. I would steal that other golf cart, but I just don't trust doing that. I've got a feeling that might end badly. For me, that might break course rules, and you have to finish. If you break course rules, you start from hole one. So... We're not gonna try and break the course rules. Perfect hit. Oh yes. Get out there. 267. That's New the record, longest drive on the hole. Nice. Oh, we're down to two holes left with about a little over two minutes left in the video. In the regular video, but I'm gonna. Pro, I'll just go ahead and press it out a little bit longer so I don't have to next episode bore people with the uh, rest of golfing and skip this episode. <clears throat> um, that's just not even cool. That is my largest shot. Okay, I guess I'm going to go that way with it. I would say hopefully I'd overpower it and get over the sand, but I think I'm going to put it right in the sand, aren't I? Yep. Sunk Fuck in. Fuck this shit. Fucking sand pit. Alrighty, well that's terrible. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure that's right in the sand, barely. I am going with the power shot here. I need to. I need to give it a large. I need to give it a real power swing here. Oh, I better be in a playable spot. Okay, it's playable. All right. 
So yeah, I guess I was doing okay, but now, ugh, now it's just kind of... And of course, Swing from the Rough does the same freaking thing. At least I got it on there, so now I can finish up. Not bad. And... hit. Oh. Come on. And you'll put it in automatically for that one. Alright, so we have one hole remaining, so we'll be a little bit over time than I hoped. But one hole to go. Alright. So, plus two, hopefully I can get... Oh man, I gotta run. See, I don't have a golf cart, so... Hopefully I'll be able to get a little... Hopefully I get a nice, good, uh... Good hole here and get away. And maybe get myself back in the lead. With a uh, negative one or so. so Alright, yep, nine... Par four. Ugh, that means I'm gonna get it in two shots. So I think it's gonna be two drives, and I have to hope the drive hits. Yeah, I'm gonna have to hope the last shot just squeezes it in there. All right. Yep. Oh, I'm... Nice line. Mm. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get the. Uh... I highly doubt I'll be having the chance to. Uh... Finish with a positive score. Well, they actually technically, I guess, say negative. Positive is bad, I guess. So, guess this is doable. Here we go. Oh, and swing. And swing! Ah, uh, nope, it's gonna be off a little bit. Yeah, it's off. Okay, so I just gotta put it in, so I'll probably be a plus one. Unless this hole misses, unless this shot doesn't get in there. But I think I'll have a plus one. Oh, come on, you. So I'm gonna get a plus two, even. Yep, I get plus two because of that. So we get par, plus two for the course. Two over par. Alright. Well. Alright, so this has been Chlor132. If you have enjoyed the video, please uh, yeah, do the useless. usual. You guys know what to do. So, hope you all have enjoyed. We will see you all next time. Have a great day.